Race number eight of the evening has Rockin' Party, Rusty Roddy, likely to win. H.P. Prosciutto, Dragjet, Bugger Max, Elm Grove, Maddie, Late Night, and Melanie's Magic. They're off and uh, pacing Rusty Roddy, getting the first call, likely to win. Moves out second at the rail. That is Rockin' Purdy to get away in the three spot up on the outside. Bugger Max into four. Inside and racing from five is H.B. Brasito Dragjet. Then settling out in six as they continue into the back stretch for time one. And out of the opening quitter is Elm Grove Matty. Back in seven late night and eighth and treading is Melanie's Magic. They race past that opening quitter. And up to grab the lead is likely to win. Now on top by a length and a half. Racing along in the pocket is Rusty Roddy. Second rock and party looks at it from three. Now stepping out first over from four is Bugger Max. H.B. Bushido drag jet with all of that cover from five. 28 and one was the quitter. They move off the turn, entering the stretch now for time one. And up front, the leader is likely to win as they race past the halfway marker. A length and a half, two lengths back. Second is Rusty Roddy. First over advancer. That is Bugger Max. Third inside. Rock and Party is fourth. Getting a second over tow in five is H.B. Bushido Drag Jet. Outside Elm Grove Matty. Third over in six. Then the Melody's Magic is seven and trailing is late night into the back stretch for the final time. The half reached in 58 seconds flat. It's likely to win on top. Second as they approach three quarters. That's Rusty Roddy Bugger. Max uncovered third. Fourth inside is Rockin' Purdy. H.P. Bushido drag jet within striking range. Spotted second over fifth. They head now to the seven eights. And they're still chasing likely to win in the front end. Bugger Max inching in on the outside. In the pocket is Rusty Roddy. They're midway Around the final turn, 127 and 1. The three quarters, it's still likely to win the leader. Rusty Roddy in the pocket, second, Bugger Max, the third one. Coming through, high HP Bushitter, drag jet fourth. Down the stretch they come. It's likely to win on top. Rusty Roddy outside, likely to win. Rusty Roddy, likely to win. Will win. Second is Rusty Roddy, tight for third. Bugger Max against a closing HP Bushitter, drag jet.
Now back into the Woodmere Standard Braids winner's circle. The winner of race eight, number three, likely to win. Nine-year-old got a ton of Western Terror, owned by Blennis Young and Lester Campbell, along with Jeffrey Campbell. Melissa Renee trains, Adam Erner drives, likely to win. A winner in 156 and uh, four-fifths. Cooler in the eighth race, in memory of the late Ross Tool, who campaigned at many horses over the years here at Truro Raceway including Atlantic Breeders' Crown three-year-old winner, Tools Gold. He also campaigned other horses, such as Putnam's Force, Salzburg Quick, and uh, Keep the Ball Rolling. His tradition in harness racing is carried on by his daughters, who are in victory lane, to make the clear presentation to the winner of the Ross Tool Memorial, likely to win, and Adam Erner. This race replay proudly brought to you by Home Hardware Building Center.